it is a passage of scripture where Apostle Paul uh, was writing to uh, Timothy. Uh, Timothy was his acquaintance, and um, Timothy, we know him as a young, gifted um, worker, or rather, um, preacher of the gospel. But uvela jengo mundo onga tu nuko saba uvela jengo mundo onga zuta kaze temi, and uh, but we if we read more on him, we, we discover that his background was of um, of a Jewish background, and he knew the scriptures. But Timothy was still timid. Timothy lacked confidence. Timothy had fears, and Apostle Paul is addressing his fears. Uti, God has not given us the spirit of fear but of power the bible talks about that we have the spirit of power and um, the spirit of love and the spirit of a sound mind i want us to address our fears in our prayers and uh, address our lack of confidence and ask of god to give us boldness we see i think about that boldness the bible uh, when the spirit of god um comes upon you in the book of Acts, when the spirit of the Lord comes upon you, you shall receive the power. You shall receive the power when the spirit of God comes against you. And then you will go out and preach the gospel. So there's so many things as a Timothy who be bold, Bazalwan. So we are not uh, to be fearful. Fear is not of God. Fear is not from God. But we have the spirit of power. We have the spirit of love and we have the spirit of sound mind that means that cancels anxiety that cancels depression that cancels low self-esteem that cancels your your lack of confidence a uh, you are you are going to need boldness for you to be able to do anything that idea that you have for a business will require boldness from you the ideas that you have the interview that you are supposed to to the job that you require will will need confidence from you will need boldness for anything the ministry that you want to take to, to 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 start will require a boldness from you so if you are of fear that is not of god the spirit of fear is the one that we need to cancel let's pray father in the mighty name of jesus i thank you Help us to trust in you. Help Help us to depend on you. Help us not to forget that you are with us always. We pray for the boldness. We pray for confidence. May we not worry about anything, just like you've said in the word. May we always know that you are our God and you are on our side. May we not worry about what's going to happen tomorrow. May we not worry about what we are going to do. May we not worry worry about what we are going to eat because we know that you are our provider. May we know may, may we address our fears Christ was a Nazareth even when anxiety knocks at our door that you become our peace. That you be our courage. That you be our confidence oh Father in the mighty name of Jesus. May we find confidence in your word. May we find confidence in knowing that you never leave us nor for us. May we know and always know that you are always with us, O oh Father Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. May we know that even when we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, 